welcome back to my channel oh, I took my hair out finally after about um, two months remember the goddess braids I have a tutorial if you haven't yet checked it out I'm gonna either link it up here or here or in the description box so you can click that and check it out this is what my hair looks like now you guys can see it has grown a lot from the time that I cut it this video it was supposed to be me trying out putting gel in my hair like the whole thing like drenching it drenching it in gel of course I've used gel in my hair like so many different times and the only one that I used to use so regularly was eco styler gel and then I found this one from Amazon I have some here for sale so if you're in Malaysia and you want to buy just hit me up you know I'm just going to start I will do it bit by bit so probably if I undo this side I detangled it I've been washing my hair like periodically so at the time I had my braids in my hair so I haven't washed it yet but it's not dirty at all well not I shouldn't say at all but it's not dirty like you know how if you take your braids out it's gonna be quite dirty yeah it wasn't like that so I'll just slightly detangle first I'm looking here cuz I can't see if I'm looking so take some gel how this idea came about was I actually did put gel on my hair yesterday just randomly and then I was just like you know what let me do a video putting gel in my whole hair oh ooh, you see that it's not even focused <laughs> I already have a video of me using this for a sleek look can you hear like some ASMR right so I put that all in my hair rake it in this is called the shingling method and I do have a tutorial on my channel but that was about what two three years ago let me zoom in a bit oh my hands are messed up <laughs> oh no okay it's okay I'm just gonna zoom in so that you can see properly what is happening So this is the hair, just naturally separating on its own. I haven't done anything. I'm gonna put some more. I want to see what it's gonna be like if I put a lot. It's not the usual amount that I use. And this is on dry hair. I'm not sure what it will be like on wet or damp hair. Moving on to the next section. You have to make sure that your hair is properly detangled so that when you are dividing it like this, you don't have any major problems. This gel is so strong, oh my gosh. <laughs> I think I may need to assist the dividing of this one. You see how the hair has just shrunk on me already? So I've done about two thirds of this half. It's white and I'm hoping it's gonna dry clear. I am not sure. One way I found to make it easier is to use a comb. So I have this big white tooth comb here. Once my hair is saturated with the gel, I just rake it through to detangle it further. And then now I'm just going to separate the hair individually. I'm left with this tiny section here. Work in smaller sections. 
So that way your hair is like coated properly with the gel. It's quite a messy job and the fact that I have detangled hair, I mean shed hair or broken hair, whichever one, <laughs> inside it makes it look like this. See? It's a messy, messy, messy job. The times that I used Eco Styler to do this, um, the roots always took very long to dry. There are times that I use the blow dryer, but then I'm trying to stay away from heat, so I don't think I'll be doing that. I don't know how long this is going to take to dry. I I just went to wash these because they were just too gooey, you know. I don't know what it looks like. I haven't checked. It looks like the back is drying. Up. The dry part looks like it has dried clear. I have to shake it, right? That was a fail. <laughs> Can we acknowledge the beauty of natural hair? <laughs> on one side, it looks like this. On the other side, like this, you know? So much versatility. What do you guys think? Uh, let me know. Of course, by the time this video is out, you know whether or not I did the full thing or not. So, I don't know. I'm torn between finishing up, finishing it up and then with the same gel. Finishing it up at all or using eco salad gel, I'm not sure. I'll see. I'll decide. I'll decide. So it's been about 45 minutes now, 45 minutes to an hour. I took a break, went to eat, just chilled around for a while and then let this dry. So it's still, as you may be able to see, it's not dry completely yet. And then I started on this side using Eco Styler Gel. So let's see how that goes. It definitely doesn't have as much hold as um, the Got To Be Glue. Hey, not Got To Be Glue, I'm not using that. Should I actually, no, I'm not gonna use that. <laughs> then the Gorilla Snot. I detangle the hair a bit and then take some gel. This is the gel. Eco Styler Gel. Battle of the Gels. Maybe I can name the video there. I don't know. So I'm taking like that much and applying it on the length of my hair. bit tangled there. I'm taking some more. I think I should use this. Separating it now. So 
So I'm gonna do majority of the hair, the rest of the hair, and then I'll be back. See why it's important to detangle before? This is why. On the last section now, the Eco Styler Gel side is really white compared to the Gorilla Snot side. So I'm done. Uh, I had some heat damage at the bottom here. I think I should just cut off this damaged side. I'm really not feeling this. I think I'll just cut. It doesn't look good. You see dead ends. You need to really cut dead ends off. It just does not look good. Or maybe I'll, I'll wait. Even if it shrinks up, like even when it dries, it's still gonna hang there. So I really do want to cut it off. But I wanted to do a lens check because after I cut my hair a year ago, I haven't done that. I think I should just cut it. Yeah, I'll just cut it. This side I think is okay, right? Oh. But here is obvious. You can see such a difference in the pattern when it gets here. Alright. Off it goes. Cutting off dead ends 2019. No dead ends in 2020. Off. And then here. I think I should just do this one too. Okay. I'm just gonna wait for it to air dry. I really don't want to blow dry it. I don't know how long it's gonna take, but if I come back the next day, you should know that it took me long. Hey, I'm back. It's been about 45 minutes. So this is what it's looking like now. Obviously, I've lost some sunlight. It's quite dry, but the base, like I said earlier, is still not dry. This one, you can see the white patches and whatnot. Oh, wow. Yeah, I definitely can. I'm sure I'll be back tomorrow because it's not dry. Hi guys, obviously it's the next day. <laughs> I think you can tell. <laughs> I'm back here with my hair. This side has really dried like completely. Well, should I say completely? I just gotta put my hands inside. It feels dry, you know? But it feels just like, it feels like it's 90% dry. And then this side, no, it's not like, it, especially at the roots. Look at this, look. Can you see the, it's, it's not dry. Let me zoom in.
it has some definition but just i don't know and which is crazy because until i tried this gel i always thought you guys gel was really good at defining my hair but now as you can see not really And then like the root, there's some flakes inside already. The difference, you can see that this side has a lot more stretch than this side. This side is more defined, this side is not as defined and it has shrunk a lot more. It seems like this side has more body and then this one has more length and definition. So what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. But this is the next day and I think I'm going to wrap up this video. Which side do I prefer? Well, in terms of definition, this side, in terms of volume. Um, hmm. I'm feeling this side. Yeah. In terms of volume this side in terms of length this side what else is there to mark it against it feels this side feels crunchy definitely this one doesn't feel as crunchy yeah it actually doesn't feel really crunchy so this is day one here I don't think I'll be coming back to let you guys like see like day two day three and stuff because I want to get this video out but you can try it for yourselves and see this is what the back looks like You can clearly see the difference. Let me know which side you prefer. This side with the eco... No. <laughs> this side with the Gorillas Not Gel. Or this side with the Eco Salad Gel. Let me know in the comments. I'll see you guys in my next video. Take care and don't forget to like, share, comment. And if you haven't already, subscribe. Bye. God bless.